Sophie was home from school with the sniffles. She curled up on the couch with her favorite blanket and whispered, I wish I knew how my body fights off germs. Just then, poof, a sparkly swirl of light appeared. Out popped a tiny floating creature with glasses and a lab coat. Hi, Sophie. I'm Dr. Dot, your body's helper. Want to meet your super spleen? Sophie's eyes lit up. Yes, please. With a whoosh, Sophie and Dr. Dot shrank down small, smaller than a crumb, and zoomed into her tummy. Where are we? asked Sophie, looking around. This, said Dr. Dot proudly, is your spleen. It lives just under your ribs on the left side. The spleen looked like a big purple jelly bean with little doors opening and closing. Out came tiny superheroes with capes. Some wore red, others wore blue. These are your blood cells, said Dr. Dot. Your spleen checks them every day to see if they are healthy. A red blood cell saluted Sophie. We carry oxygen. The spleen keeps only the best of us. Did you know? A red blood cell's scientific name is called erythrocyte. Suddenly, a squiggly green germ bounced in. Ew, said Sophie. Don't worry, said Dr. Dot. The spleen's got it. A white blood cell leapt out with a vacuum cleaner sucked up the germ and gave a thumbs up. Dr. Dot showed Sophie a special room inside the spleen. This is the blood bank. Your spleen stores extra blood just in case your body needs it. Sophie peeked at shelves of sparkling red liquid in jars. Cool! It's like a juice fridge, she giggled. Whoosh! Sophie zoomed back to the couch. Her mum peeked in. Feeling better, Sophie? Sophie smiled. A little. My super spleen's on the job. My spleen is a superhero, she said. She pulled her blanket tight and whispered. Thank you, spleen. Here's some fun facts about your spleen. Number one, your spleen is about the size of your fist. The spleen in a healthy child or adult is usually about the size of a closed fist. It's soft and spongy and shaped kind of like a jelly bean or a thick leaf. It sits on the left side of your body just under your ribs near your stomach. Your spleen is small, but it plays big roles in keeping you healthy. Think of your spleen like a small pillow tucked under your ribs that keeps your blood clean and fights off the bad guys or the germs. Number two, your spleen helps fight germs and clean your blood. The spleen has two major jobs. Firstly, it fights infections. It contains white blood cells, that's your immune soldiers, that find and destroy bacteria, viruses and other bad guys that make you sick. And secondly, your spleen filters your blood. It checks your blood like a quality control manager. If any blood cells are old, damaged or broken, the spleen takes them out and recycles them. So your spleen is like a superhero headquarters, plus it's like a recycling center inside your body. It finds the villains, that's the germs, and gets rid of them. And it also cleans up the mess. Number three. You can live without the spleen, but it's super helpful. Some people need to have their spleen removed. For example, 
if it's injured or it's diseased. And yes, you can live without it. But your spleen makes your immune system stronger when it's there. If someone loses their spleen, other parts of their body like the liver and bone marrow help take over its jobs. Imagine the spleen is part of your body's superhero team. If it has to leave, the other heroes like the brain, the kidney, the heart can still do the job, but it's always better with the whole team. Number 4. The spleen stores extra blood. The spleen stores extra red blood cells and platelets. Platelets are the cells that help stop bleeding. If your body needs them fast, like if you get cut or lose blood, the spleen can release this backup supply quickly. So the spleen is like a backup juice box your body keeps in the fridge. If you are low on your body juice, that's the blood, the spleen can give you some in an emergency. Number five, the spleen checks every blood cell like a scanner. Red blood cells travel through the spleen. The spleen checks each one to make sure it's still working properly. If it's too old or damaged, the spleen takes it out and recycles it. So imagine the spleen has a tiny scanner that goes beep as each blood cell walks through. Good cells get to keep working. Bad ones go to the recycling room. Now let's talk about how to keep your super spleen happy. Number one, eat rainbow foods. Your spleen loves colors on your plate. So try to eat lots of colorful fruits and vegetables like red apples, orange carrots, green broccoli, yellow bananas, and blueberries. These foods have vitamins that make your blood strong and help your body fight off germs. Number two, move your body every day. Jump, dance, run, your spleen loves it. Playing tag, riding a bike, or dancing around the house helps your blood move around your body. Good blood flow keeps your spleen busy and happy. Number three, drink plenty of water. Water helps your body stay clean. Water keeps your blood flowing and helps your spleen wash away old blood cells and germs. Try to drink water with every meal and after playing. Number four, be gentle with your tummy. Your spleen hides under your ribs, so keep it safe. Don't roughhouse, wrestle, or bump your belly too hard, especially on the left side. If you feel a belly ache, tell a grown-up right away. Number five, sleep like a star. Your spleen works best when you're rested. When you sleep, your whole body, including your spleen, gets time to recharge. A good night's sleep helps your body grow strong and stay healthy. Number six, clean your hands to keep germs away. Wash your hands before eating, after playing outside and after going to the bathroom. Fewer germs mean your spleen doesn't have to work so hard. Hope you enjoyed the story. Until next time, please like, share and subscribe.